Hey guys, I'm Chang Jifun. Thank you, Kondo JJ. I graduated with master's degree in Japan. I graduated from bachelor a uh, bachelor's undergraduate course in, in Korea. I'm working in Japan over than three years long. I'm I'm living in Japan over than six years long. Yeah. Uh, uh, this video, uh, this video is like, uh. How to change Japanese version, Windows 10 to English version. Uh, I just record this video when I installed Windows 10 the first time, uh, first time of my life. Just recorded this one and shared on the YouTube. Then 70,000 people, I don't know, not a lot of people that. Then 70,000 played already. Oh, thank you. I didn't care about it too much, just like record it and share it. That's all. Yeah. And many people yeah play this video. Yeah. It's cool. Yeah. By the way, I saw some uh many comments over here. So one guy uh request me uh Korean to Japanese uh Korean to English, yeah. Let's see. Korean. Yes, this guy. Tepa Mukeshi. Can you help me on Korean to English, please? And I replied to him. I try to. I try to when I have time. I'm busy with job hunting now. Actually, I have job interview today. It's one a.m. already, so I I have job job interview at six p.m. today. But I'm recording. I'm recording this video for him. Because I want to help some people, yeah. By the way, uh, if you want to see any lang old languages in English, it'd be better clean install. But I show you, you can say, easy way to change your display language on your Windows 10, you know. And maybe you, you have many, some mis uh, you can say, hesitate about some buttons because the Inter interface changed a little bit in settings so yeah my first video wasn't so helpful I think so maybe yes maybe no yeah by the way just follow me I'll show you how to change uh, display language from Korea, uh, Korean to English uh, click the Windows button a button Windows button that you can see this button, then you can read Seolchong. Maybe you can't read it. Yeah, this Korean say Seolchong is meaning settings. Click, click this one, and yeah, uh, in center, you can see many icons up here. In center, this button, this icon, showing clock over here, and A, and this is a uh, meaning character of Chinese character, huh? And you can see this this character, Korean character, Shigamit Seolchong is meaning uh Shigamit ano? I'm sorry, Shigamit ano is meaning time and languages. Kli. And yeah, let's see this one. These tabs, yeah. Here's three tabs. Please see middle middle one. Jiangmit or no is meaning region and language. Click. Uh, this one is region, but it's not so important, right? If you want to change your display language, you, you must change this this click uh, this button. But uh, normally when you start is um, you can see use your Windows uh, new computer and it's uh you can see if it's Korean version, you can you can see only one language up here, Korean, Hangugo. But I can see three languages because I I installed already. You can see here, right? So this button is added uh ono chuga add languages. So you need add language first. Yeah, click this plus, and search your language. English. Yeah. I installed the United States English already. Let's try to 
uh, Australia English. Click this one, and this button is down. It's meaning next click. Then you can see three options over here. Uh, this this option is meaning the Windows 표시 언어로 설정. It's meaning uh default display language. You know this 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 language to my Windows display language setting. You know. So if you click this one, then and install it and sign out, sign in, then you can see all the English. Uh, you see language uh, English characters over here. You know. And this this option is like uh voice voice fi files voice function files. So if you click this one, yeah, you can use um, uh, Cortana over here, right? And this is writing writing function files. So if you install this one, you can yeah handwriting by using tablet PC. But my PC is not a tablet PC, so I don't need this one. By the way, uh yeah. And this button is uh, uh, installation, yeah, search it. installation. So it's, and you can click, you click this, then yeah, you can install, you can start install, you know. But yeah, I don't need to install right now, so I cancel. It's like chisel is meaning cancel. Install, installation, cancel, you know. Yeah, installed already. Korean. English and Japanese. I just choose English over here. And the Windows button, click uh, click Windows button, and this one is a uh, account icon. Click, and yeah, maybe you don't. If you don't know about some screen character, you gonna uh, yeah, uh, you're gonna be chaos over here. Yeah, right. This this button is uh log log out. Log out. Korean say log out. Uh, log out. Log out. I'm sorry. Korean say log out. English say log out. It's meaning uh, as uh, sign out. Yeah, please click this one and sign out. And then just log, uh, sign in again. Yeah. That's all. Hey guys, I will load, uh, I signed on, uh, signed in again. And, yeah, let's click Windows button. Then, you can see English over here. You finally see your language over here, right? Start, documents, pictures, settings, power. But you can see still, yeah, Japanese over here because it's not a uh, I can say clean install. Just like it's very convenient to change the display language. You know, that's all. If you wanna, if you want uh, clean English, be the better clean install. That's my recommendation. So yeah, Windows 10 changed its uh, interface a little bit. So the setting menu yeah was changed than first version of the Windows 10. So my first video um, would also help the, you guys maybe I don't know maybe maybe yes maybe no so I just I sh I just showed you how to change your display languages over here that's all thank you have a nice day.